All right, Chase, thanks. On to some other races now. Michael Allen will be the next district attorney for the 4th Judicial District. He won over El Paso County Commission Chair Mark Waller. Here are those numbers for you. Michael Allen with 55%, Mark Waller with 46%. The margin never really changed throughout the evening. News Channel 13's Crystal Story caught up with Michael Allen this evening. She joins us live with more on this race. Crystal. Bart, he won't have to move very far. He already works in the office behind us. Uh, Michael Allen told us today that he's excited for this new challenge. A big win tonight for the next fourth judicial district attorney. I'm ready to get started. It's clear that voters, they value experience and I'm just so relieved and excited to get to work. Michael Allen, who currently serves under Dan May, the current district attorney, celebrated the promotion to his new role, but promised change. Uh, the George Floyd murder certainly has changed the conversation, and we've got to be involved in that conversation. We've got to be actively listening to people, and I want to get out into the community and listen to people. His opponent, Mark Waller, was sad to hear the loss. Uh, it's a tough night. Uh, it obviously feels terrible. I, I really expected a different outcome, but uh, this is where we are. Waller's term as county commissioner ends this year, but he isn't sure what his next move is yet. I've enjoyed every second of being able to uh, have that connection with my community and being a leader in my community, and we'll see what the next chapter holds. <laughs> Now, some of the changes Michael Allen says he plans on implementing when he takes office is more consistent penalties for animal cruelty and changing how homicide cases are given to other prosecutors. Uh, for now, we're live outside the district attorney's office. Crystal Story, Cardio News Channel 13.